as you can see here we have a uh, Porsche 914 it has uh, the two litre four cylinder engine in it and as you can see there it's uh, quite a neat fit in the engine bay but uh, it does fit in quite neatly so today I'm going to run through the components of the Bosch DJetronic uh, injection system now down here we have the uh, manifold pressure sensor which controls the um, mixture at different uh, load uh, ratings so that has a vacuum line onto it here which works on a diaphragm inside controlling electronically the mixture which is connected to the computer here so it's the ECU there which actually has a uh, mixture uh, control knob or adjusting knob on the end of it which has about one and three quarter turns of adjustment which is all calibrated with the with notches on the actual um, on the actual uh, knob so it will only go click 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 so it has quite a few different settings and each one is usually quite a uh, noticeable adjustment now uh, one other key thing with these is the uh, distributor you can see the distributor cap right here now there's a wire here that runs down into the bottom of the distributor which has a set of points similar for the um, normal in ignition system but these points actually control the uh, signal for the injectors to operate now when these are actually uh, the injectors are fired in groups with these so it has two sets of points and two circuits there for the uh, firing of those injectors the signal again for that is sent up into the ECU and again the ECU makes all its decisions based on the MPS sensor and it will then uh, adjust the settings to suit as far as the injector open time goes now over down here if you can see it we have the injectors which they don't really show up very clearly here let me see if I can zoom in there ah there we go the injectors are down in there and these just have a barbed fitting for the fuel line to go on and they are a very simple sort of a thing they're just a solenoid which opens and shuts a valve same as any other injectors now over here is your throttle body your throttle position switch is over here let me see if we can get in there yep and again that tells the computer what position or percentage of opening the actual uh, throttle is in so therefore it works with the MPS sensor to determine a injector open time so they uh, both work together and separately from each other now we'll just move over to the other side of the engine and hopefully we'll see a bit more there so again we have the um, injectors down in here and I'll just move the light so we've got some chance to see a bit better there we go and uh, there we go we've got a good view of it here so we've got the injectors down in there injector there and then right here we have the um, fuel pressure regulator which you can actually hopefully you'll be able to see the adjusting screw on the end which has got a locking nut on it and that gives you the opportunity to actually adjust the fuel pressure so these engines or these uh, systems run on about 28 to 35 uh, psi of fuel pressure which compared to a uh, later type of uh, injection system 
uh, is quite low because uh, the later Algetronics and aftermarket computer systems or injection systems actually run at about uh, a minimum of about 45 psi so they'll run from anywhere anywhere from that up and, and pr usually um, anything up to about 60 pounds of uh, fuel pressure now the Djetronic system is actually used in a lot of Mercedes, Porsches, VWs um, and a lot of cars from the early 70s so at the time it was quite a uh, common system to be found but in these days a lot of them have actually been replaced with either a um, either a uh, aftermarket injection system carburetors or you know whatever else people decide to use but there's a bit of an overview on the old Djetronic uh, Bosch injection system